welcome to Eric City Welsh Garden. Today is New Year's Eve and I thought I'd bring you along while I'm doing some gardening to talk about some of my plans for 2019. Firstly though, I just need to get this pear tree planted. So this is a duo pear tree, it's a concord and a conference and I got it bare rooted about a month ago so um, I'm really grateful that I've got the time today to get it into the ground. So that's the pear tree all planted now, hopefully it's going to be here for a very long time providing me with loads of free pears every single year. Also don't you just love hearing this? all of the birds that have come out to join me in the garden today it's absolutely amazing i'm so lucky to live where i do anyway let's talk about my goals for 2019. so goal number one is to get the greenhouse up now we got this back in march for free um, and it was quite hard work getting it all down then we put the base here which is the only flat bit of the um garden and coincidentally the only kind of patch of the garden that gets any light um, but it was still a little bit uneven and we kind of put it down and realized that we did really also need to kind of dig a little foundation around it and put some hard stones down there so pretty much we got to this stage and left it so about um, two weeks ago I did put some cardboard all around it just to kill off the grass so it was much easier for me to be able to kind of level it off so that is number one 2019 get the greenhouse up now the second goal that i really want to achieve is to completely clear all of the crocosmia out of this kind of raised rockery area it possibly used to be a pond there back a long time ago but it's completely full of bricks and debris and loads of crocosmia corms now the crocosmia here is kind of the old victorian version which is very invasive there's a small patio just where these blue um, pots are on that has crocosmia completely growing up throughout it so i would really love to get this rockery completely crocosmia free and turn it into an amazing growing area this part of the garden really catches the Sun during the day so if I can get that to a really productive vegetable area then that would be amazing goal number three is to grow more perennial veg next year I'm gonna be growing these ochre which I've never grown before I've got a couple of different colors and I'm so excited to try these so Goal number four is to become self-sufficient in at least one type of veg. Now, I'm hoping in 2019, that veg is going to be garlic. I have about 18 thermodrome garlic bulbs growing here at home, and I also have about 74 growing at the allotment. Now, with garlic, most of it is imported from China or Spain. So if I can grow my own at home, I can really help reduce food miles, but also grow some really tasty varieties. Number five is to start growing some heirloom varieties of vegetables. I'm doing this by supporting the Heritage Seed Library next year. And as part of the support, they offer you up to six varieties of vegetables from the Heritage Seed Library list that you can choose to grow next year. Now, I'm going to be doing a completely different video all about this because I think it's so exciting. And I'm going to be doing this on my live chat on Friday. If you're watching this after the live chat, I will put a link in the card so you can catch up with that video. But in the meantime, if you really are interested in learning more about the heritage seed library i'll put a link below and if you support them you've still got up to the 2nd of february i believe to actually choose your varieties to grow next year i'm heading off inside now but i really hope you've enjoyed watching my 2019 goals i really can't wait to hear yours either and i hope every single one of you has an amazing new year and we all have a fabulous growing season if you're new to my channel don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring the bell so you can be notified of all my latest videos i have so much planned for 2019 and it will be great for you to come along on the journey thanks very much for watching take care bye